Uh, I can see the wire you're talking about. It looks like it's in good shape from here. We'll follow it up to the top of the trail if you can. You can head back as soon as you give me the all clear. Got it. Hey, so there are beer cans all over the ground up here leading up the hill. That's annoying. Yeah, thing is, there were a bunch down at that campsite yesterday. Coincidence, maybe? I don't think so. Same brand, everything. These fucking kids. Why do you think they'd be up here? Hell if I know, but they better have stayed away from our communication stuff. Uh, yeah, okay, the wire's down here. Okay, good. Any sign of those girls? Did they mess with anything? I'll look around. Hey, so the wire is definitely down out here. I just found it. Yeah, the thing is, it doesn't look like the wind. It looks like it was cut deliberately. I knew it. The moment you said you found their trash. Oh, these idiots are gonna pay. Do they realize this is how people die? I mean, what if something happened to one of my lookouts while this was going on? And God forbid there's an actual fire burning out of control. What do you want to do? I want you to go find them. And then what? I... I haven't thought that far ahead. That's not true. Everything that comes to mind is illegal. Hmm. Let's hear it. Oh, yeah? Hey, I came out here for a breath of fresh air and some adventure. What do you got? I think I want you to just find them and scare the hell out of them. Yeah, I'd make a spooky ghost costume, but they stole my sheets. Hmm, I don't know. Um... Wait for them to wander off and wreck their camp. Something that would make a teenage girl run home to mommy and daddy. <laughs> I'll find them. Thanks. But I am gonna need a raise. <sighs> Don't hold your breath. I'd start by hiking back towards your tower and just keep an eye out for anything that would lead you to them. Well, they're big into Red Eagle. <laughs> Great. See if you can find the path they took down from there. Maybe they looped back around towards the lake or something. I doubt they're where they were yesterday, but they obviously can't have gone far.
Well, I hopped down a drop, and now I can't climb back up. Hmm, that is a pickle. I, mean, I can just keep hiking, but I figured I should let you know in case I get myself trapped out here. Well, hopefully that doesn't happen before you find these assholes. I was thinking you should probably head back to where you saw them last. I've got an overgrown trail here. Yeah, that'll happen. So I'm screwed when it comes to getting past it? Mm-hmm. Screwed until you clear it yourself, yeah. Great. Well, if I come across some tools, I'll add groundskeeping to my ever-increasing list of responsibilities. There's an abandoned pack out here. And it's not one of the teens? No, it looks like it was lost a long time ago. Well, you could always pilfer it for supplies. Well, I am flush with ropes now. That pack was full of them, in decent condition, too. That's lucky. I mean, there's, there's enough rope here that I could just leave them hooked up, I think. Oh, get this, this uh, pack came with one of those cardboard single-use cameras. With pictures left? Yeah, he only used three or four. Neato. Thank you, Brian Goodwin. Wait, wait, who? The bag had the name Brian Goodwin sewn into the top. Huh. Wow. Do you know him? Yeah, I just haven't heard that name in a few years. Thank you. 
He was a lookout? <laughs> yeah, kinda, I guess. He was stationed in Two Forks, near lookout, with his dad Ned three summers ago. Great kid. You can bring children out here? No. You know, I'm not a stickler for rules. They took off halfway through the summer. You guys keep in touch, you and the Goodwin kid? Nah, they took off pretty unceremoniously. Plus, <laughs> what's a 40-year-old woman gonna do with a teenage pen pal? Hmm, good point. Anyway, so it goes. Have, uh, fun with that camera. Try not to snap anything that would scar a Photodome employee. I don't know, I got a lot of hiking to do. Might get bored. Well, I'm bored as rocks, so I'll keep you company while you find those girls, huh? about snapping at you earlier. Um, I thought about it and... Yeah, I suppose that must have sounded kind of weird when you heard me take that other call. Plus, you're just out here in your own head. <laughs> Trust me, I know how it is. So... Did you break any hearts back in Colorado when you took this job? I myself have chosen to never get attached to anyone who would miss me, but... <laughs> I know I'm a bit of an outlier. I'm actually married. But you're here. She's sick. And I shouldn't be here, but I am. I... I'm sorry, Henry. What is it? We'll get into it. Okay. Well, in the meantime, you are here, and it's beautiful, and escaping isn't always something bad. Yeah, sure. Look, I gotta go do a thing, but I'll have a radio. Okay, call me if you need to. Uh, someone found a fossil and put it in a cash box. Could be the same person who left that antler. Maybe they're leaving me an entire creature, piece by piece. <laughs> 